Hi everyone, today we're back with the Public Works. It's a cold morning here in Elk Mountain, Wyoming. The temperature is just touching 5 degrees. And overnight guys, we got a big snowstorm. I think we're at 7 or 8 inches here in town. Now the Public Works Department called me last night saying they were shorthanded and asked if I could help out plowing the town roads this morning. So that's what we're going to do. Let's get the uh, Ford truck warmed up here for a few minutes and then we'll get going. Like always guys, there's a full mods list link down below. And if you end up enjoying today's video, help me out by hitting the like button. Alright, before we leave the house, I want to put this in four wheel drive high because it looks like none of the town roads are plowed out yet. And guys, it is super exciting because schools are closed and a lot of employers are having the uh, employees work from home here today. So hopefully there's not going to be too many cars out on the road to make it easier for us snow plowing. Having a big truck like this with four wheel drive sure does come in pretty handy because I did see it all over that small sedans and other vehicles were getting stuck uh, in the snow here. It is uh, deep in some areas, especially with the different wind gusts here, but we are just now getting over to the local public works department. It's a smaller one here in Elk Mountain, Wyoming, but you guys can see, look at their fleet. It looks like they have a pickup truck here, a few uh, international trucks here, and wow, look at that, a few loaders. They look to both be John Deere's, but this one, oh, this one looks to be pretty old, but in good condition here. So since we're the only ones here first, I actually want to hop in the pickup truck, see if we can kind of help uh, kind of plow this out. That way, uh, all the other trucks could uh, get on out plowing uh, easier. This is one pretty cool light bar up top this truck here. I haven't seen one of these in farm sims, so that's quite unique. It is a little bit older here, but this looks to be an older pickup truck, probably around uh, the 2004 to 06 uh, generation here. But I'm only going to make a pass or two just to really get this opened up for us. And that way, all the other trucks can leave on time here. And also, we get to run this pretty neat truck here. But we're going to be taking one of the internationals, and we are going to be plowing the county roads here. Now, like I mentioned, hopefully there's not too much traffic. It's going to be a lot easier if there isn't. All right, we're going to be taking this international here, so we'll get it warmed up here for a few minutes. Now, I'm not sure if there's any salt in the back, but if we do have to go salt, and that's going to be later on in the day, we really need to get the roads plowed out here. It's already past uh, 7 a.m., just past it here, so we really need to get to work here, but this is a pretty neat setup. This looks to be maybe a five-year-old international here with a custom salt spreader on the back and a big, big snow plow up front here. Now, these mods, like I mentioned, guys, uh, can be found linked down below here. All these mods are actually quite new and recently released here for farms, and which is awesome. But I'm thinking, why don't we go do this small subdivision since we're here? And uh, that way they could get plowed at it out as well. But one thing, guys, plowing out all the roads is so tricky. We can't forget any of the roads, and we have to do it in a pattern where we don't uh, keep driving around town uh, just for one or two roads. This road is uh, super uh, steep here, trying to make sure we don't lose traction. I actually had to raise a plow up just a little bit to give us a little bit of momentum. Uh, otherwise, I don't think we would make it up here. Just so much snow. And like I mentioned, when they're shorthanded, uh, it seems like we're always getting the call here, which is a lot of fun. Uh, snow plowing and working for the town is uh, something that I really do enjoy doing. We're back on the main county roads here. Now, one thing we have to watch out with some of these roads is the sidewalks. We definitely don't want to be breaking any of those here, but plowing out all the roads, guys, this is going to be a several hour long process here. We have to make sure we get every road and uh, also have to make sure we clear it uh, well enough so that no cars get stuck here because I do know tow trucks today are going to be super busy. Now guys, we do have several uh, big things planned here for the channel, which I am super excited for. Hope everyone is looking forward to what's to come and some new mini series starring some old series will be coming back and we are just having a great time uh, making some pretty cool videos. Oh, look at that guys. Looks like there's a few cars out 
uh, drive-in today, which is definitely good to see, but hopefully it doesn't get too busy uh, until we end up finishing uh, plowing. Alright, I just got turned around here. We made it to the edge of the town here. The other uh, town public works takes care of that. And uh, we are super busy, so we want to keep a focus on our uh, town roads here. But you guys can see, I mean, this plow is really doing a good job. I think this is probably 12 to 14 feet wide, which is good because that means only a pass or two. And we got the entire road done here. This is actually the main road in town. That is why I'm trying to do this one first. With the Public Works Department, guys, we are responsible for everything town related from the roads to the schools and all the different parking lots like the town hall post office. So we are always super busy. And then uh, during the spring, summer and fall, we have to make sure all those properties are mowed and really kept up and making the town look good here. So we are always super busy and I've been really enjoying just helping out with the Public Works here. Once or twice a week, they seem to be calling me asking for extra uh, help or extra set of hands here and I usually end up doing it because it's just awesome and some of the equipment we get to use guys is also quite unique specific to uh, mainly just town use here but you guys can see we are making really good progress getting these roads cleared We're moving on to a small side street here. Only one pass on this is actually all we're going to have to do here, which is definitely going to be really, really good here. Now, I am just trying to make sure we don't go off on the grass too much. You don't want to be tearing up the grass of someone's front yard or... All right, we made it to the end of the road here. This is actually now moving on to the other town. So guys, I'm probably gonna put down the camera and get back to plowing here, but we are probably about halfway done plowing all the roads, which means we made good work in the short amount of time. But until next time, guys, thanks for watching. Stay tuned for our next one and subscribe for more.